Hello gamers, my name is Gabe Howard. I am Sanitization Consultant in Blizzard. Today I just received a mail with lore expansions to the world of Warcraft, and I wanted to share them with you. So let's jump right into it. First and the most important thing that we need to discuss is, is there really romantic relationships between Sylvanas Windrunner and the daughter of Cenarius Lunar? first of the Dryads of Kalimdor. I've personally seen so many theories of that, people around the internet really want to see those characters together, and the short answer, yes. They have been developing warm feelings towards each other for quite some time now. If you want to read how these two characters met, I really recommend you reading this short lore script, I'll put that in the description, first link, it covers the beginning of their relationship. And of course, as you will know, Sylvanas fell in love with beautiful Lunara at first sight. You know, lately because of the war between the Horde of the Alliance, both of these characters were kinda like Romeo and Juliet, I'd say. Parted, long time, not seeing each other, but I have here in my lore expansion confirmations that Sylvanas, while controlling Undercity, sometimes at night ran away or used portals, or I don't know, to escape to her beloved Dryad. Lord doesn't quite say where was Lunara at the time, but there was many instances of them meeting, and we know for sure that those meetings were of romantic nature. That's by the way why game in some regions, for example in Russia, now has a Peggy 16 rating. Not to the controversy of Sylvanas dating anyone else, because this is obviously fake news. That for example Sylvanas dating Nathanas Blightcaller, her student. This isn't true. He is merely her champion, I have confirmations that he is really into someone else right now. And now to the main information in the lore expansion, because we knew everything that was said before, and I wanted to talk about the burning of Teldrassil. There was some tension between our lovers lately, Sylvanas suspected some kind of romantic relations between Lunara and Tarrant Whisperwind. Uh, Sylvanas sought the capture of the wall tree Teldrassil to let the anger out of losing her girlfriend, and out of internal sorrow and loneliness she burned the tree to show Lunara that she cares, that she wants her to notice Sylvanas, she can't stand there parting, but on the outside she looked kinda calm and uh, ready, she told everyone that it was only to use this place as a safe harbor to transport Azerite from Kalimdor to Eastern Kingdoms. Uh, but we all know the truth. With that being said, we all really hope for even Tipa. Lore expansion between Lunara and Sylvanas. As fans of World of Warcraft, we all want to know what's happened in hearts of our favorite characters. If this lore expansion get enough likes from you, my fellow lore enthusiasts, I will make another one. I think about something that you were theorizing. For example, if Tyrant has affection for Elnara, or is she true to her husband, Malfurion? Uh, thanks for watching, and as always, this was Sanitization Executive Gape. I'll see you in Azeroth.